This is 10 kilometers from the Port Harcourt International Airport to Wigwe International University in Isiokpo. From the airport junction deep into the hinterland, every town wears a new look in anticipation of receiving an august visitor. Preparations for the final barrier of the Bologna business mogul, Dr. Herbert Wigwe is on a hypersonic speed. Roads have been cleared and available portholes have been fixed. Contractors handling the university projects are on their heels. The Redeemed Christian Church of God, RCCG, and Isiopo Parish are wearing a befitting look. Several hectares of land have either been donated by well-wishers or acquired by families as car parks to ease both humans and vehicular traffic on the day of burial have been set up. In all, Isiopo Kingdom looks set to receive their illustrious son back home. Yes, he is coming home to rest for eternity on Saturday, March 9, 2024. But on his arrival at the Portacourt International Airport, Omagwa, the late Wigwe would not add on his usual trademark smile. There will be no handshake, no hugging, no formal pleasantries. He will be stiff and cold, call it rigor mortis. He will be laying face up, signifying the end of all mortals. That is because death, a necessary end when it comes, will come. As if he had the premonition of his tomorrow, Dr. Herbert Wigwe had already built up a fitting private tomb for himself. Located within the massive expanse of the university environment, the mausoleum is a site worthy of a billionaire. A stamped concrete walkway sandwiched by a green lodge leads to the ecstatic final resting place of the Wigways. Three tombs have been constructed with a state-of-the-art Italian Carrara and finished off with a foreign granite galaxy. Do not grieve for the joy of the Lord is your strength is an inscription imposed on the top corner of the composing mausoleum. The site of the transparent private cemetery is a clear statement to the fact that Dr. Herbert Wigwe was not just rich while alive, he appears even richer in death. With thousands of foreign guests expected to pay their last respect to this rare gem, what will be the signature of all eyes in the expansive landmarks of the Wigwe International University? <laughs>